we challenged ourselves to make something purely digital feel natural and alive from how it looks to how it feels as it dynamically responds to touch. To achieve this, we began by rethinking the fundamental elements that make up our software. And it starts with an entirely new expressive material we call liquid glass. With the optical qualities of glass and a fluidity that only Apple can achieve, it transforms depending on your content or even your context and brings more clarity to navigation and controls. It beautifully refracts light and dynamically reacts to your movement with specular highlights. This material brings a new level of vitality to every aspect of your experience. From the smallest elements you interact with to larger ones, it responds in real time to your content and your input, creating a more lively experience that we think you'll find truly delightful. There are moments when you'd like to express an idea, question, or feeling, but a language barrier gets in the way. To help you communicate across languages, we're introducing live translation. With Apple Intelligence, live translation can translate conversations on the fly. It's integrated into messages, FaceTime, and phone. And it's enabled by Apple-built models that run entirely on device. So your personal conversations stay personal. For instance, in messages, live translation can automatically translate text for you. So if you're making plans with some new friends while studying abroad, your message can be translated as you type and delivered in their preferred language. And when they respond, each text can be instantly translated for you. When you're catching up on FaceTime, you can follow along with translated live captions while you continue to hear your grandmother's voice. Écoute ma chérie, ajoute une pincée de vanille et de l'eau de fleur d'oranger à la pâte. C'est ça mon secret. Oh, right. Yes. When you're on a phone call, your words are translated as you talk and the translation is spoken out loud for the call recipients. Hi, are you available to cater a wedding on December 6th? Hallo, sind Sie für eine Hochzeit am 6. Dezember verfügbar? Say I open a social media app and I see this great jacket. I want to know where I can get something like this. I can find out with visual intelligence and I can access it with a familiar gesture by pressing the same buttons I use to take a screenshot. Now at the top, I have screenshot controls like markup and share. At the bottom, I have visual intelligence tools like this image search button in the bottom right. I can tap here to find similar images on Google or other apps I use frequently. Thanks to visual intelligence, I know where to get a jacket like this. Let's keep scrolling. I dig this lamp. So I'll bring up visual intelligence. And now I can highlight a search for similar lamps across my most used apps, like Etsy. And when I tap on a result I like, it takes me right into the app so I can save this lamp to my favorites. With Vision OS 26, we're making your memories feel even more realistic. It uses a new AI algorithm that leverages computational depth to create multiple perspectives from your 2D photos, making the images more lifelike. These spatial scenes feel as if you could lean right into them and look around. We can't wait for you to try this out in the Photos app. You can also view these in the new Spatial Gallery app, where you can explore fresh and exciting content curated by Apple. Spatial scenes will make your web browsing experience more engaging too. Simply select Spatial Browsing to transform supported articles, hiding distractions and revealing inline photos that come alive as you scroll. We're also introducing system and app actions in Spotlight. You can take hundreds of actions from creating an event to starting an audio recording or even playing a podcast. And you can do this no matter what app you're currently working in. You can even fill out parameters for an action. Say you want to send an email. You can write the message, set the recipient, and add a subject, all without lifting your hands off the keyboard. Plus, many of our items for the app you're in can be accessed right from Spotlight. And for developers, these are surfaced in Spotlight automatically. This is great in a feature-rich app like Acorn. To make taking action in Spotlight even faster, we're introducing Quick Keys. These are short strings of characters that get you right to what you're looking for. For instance, 
Sending a message can be done by simply typing SM. And adding a new reminder can be done by typing AR, and then just typing the reminder. Quick keys are automatically provided for system and app actions you've taken. What a big day of announcements for our users and developers. We continue to advance each of our platforms with more ways to harness the power of Apple intelligence, as well as a beautiful new design, our product experiences become even more seamless and enjoyable. We're excited to see how developers will bring these updates and this new design language to their apps. Our new OS releases will be available as developer betas today, with a public beta coming next month. And they will be available to all users this fall.